Hello guys and welcome back to my channel for this week uh, episode I will not gonna show you a project that I will do it right now but uh, I would like to show you one of my future projects so uh, currently I buy this uh, cute uh, Damas bus it's a van and uh, I would like to convert this in a very cool microvan and maybe why not in a very small micro camper and uh, this is how it's looking now this is how it's looking inside and I would like to show you a few things that uh, I already made because the van when I bought it it was um, really dirty and as you can see this van needs a lot of repairs so a few things that I've uh, I've made, I uh, changed the wheels, those are not the original ones, and I add the 25mm spacers over there, I don't know if you can see it, but are right here, the shiny one. So now the wheels are 25mm uh, outside and normally, you can see on the back side. And here I will create from fiberglass some over fenders which are which will come until here on the, on the wheel. As you can see uh, this car have a lot of rust and a lot of scratches and a lot of, of dents. Uh, the handles are not working. Inside I already refurbished the cheers and you can see it here up on the video. Also, the wheels, I refurbished them, um, I found them in an old uh, company garage, I took them, I sandblasted them, then I painted them. More than this, uh, now I'm working to the uh, door panel. So in that side I remove it and as you can see I just change the um, door opening uh, handle. So this is the original and this is how we're gonna look after I will finish the door panel. Um, I put carpet inside and here under I have to paint it and uh, I will apply some rubber, let's say, um, paint, which will also gonna reduce the noise. I have also a cap for this. Then I put also rubber, so before it did, it doesn't exist. And uh, also it was looking very dirty, as you can see in the picture uploaded here. I've made as well on the other side. Continuing to presenting, this is the shock. So when you are starting the motor, you have to take this lever out. Um, the dashboard is looking really dirty and really ugly. 
sorry for the noise of the outside uh, four gears shift uh, the handbrake also the uh, high-tech um, sound system or entertainment system this door handle which is opening uh, the door it's working really good it's working like this you can close it so be nice comparing with the other one it's looking really cool after I'll finish to refurbish also the door panel and customize I'll put a low speaker here and high speaker here um, I wanted also to make a pocket here but I found out that the window is sliding right here and this is not gonna be possible but somehow I will update it and make it more um, modern This is on the front of the car. I already took the headlights uh, out and I sealed them because it was raining inside. And um, here as well, I clean everything. I have to paint it with uh, rubber paint. I add this carpet and then on top I add this rubber. This is how the door is looking now. On back side, also this uh, door handle is broken. I have a good one inside. On the other side I don't have a door handle, I have to buy one and this is the boot of the car. I'll go on the other side and open the other sliding door. The door is sliding millimeter in on the wheel and this is how it's looking and back I will take the key and I will open also the boot of the car other things that I've made I paint the floor I also sandblast the cap and the box of the battery which is located here and I changed the screws also in front I've changed, I sandblast and I uh, paint this cap and I've changed all the screws with the stainless steel ones. So this is the space on the back of the car. There are a lot of things to be done to this. Underneath also it's not looking very well. The 
exhaust was welded and it was welded very good or very bad but um, also there is some rust here which I have to repair but overall under the car it's not looking uh, very bad I mean the chassis of the car it's uh, well maintained and it's not rusty I have to change some parts for the cars for this car but at the end uh, I think I can make a very cool uh, van or camper van why not now I will show you how the engine it's starting we have to wait a few minutes for the pump this is the sound of the pump and then leave it in neutral and light it up the engine it's located here under the seat It's one part. Open this clip. And here is the other part. So the whole body of the engine is located under the seat. In big lines, this is it. I hope you enjoyed the video. As I said, I didn't, uh, I couldn't show you uh, something that I've made for this week. But uh, I will integrate this in more, let's say, video steps by transforming this micro van in a very cool one. And I will start with the door handle, door panel. Thank you very much guys, this is it. I can't ask you if you like this video to hit the thumbs up, but uh, if you want to stay uh, with me along this journey of transformation for the mini bus, mini van, mini camper, uh, then please the, hit the thumbs up and stay tuned until next episode when uh, I will show you how I will make the door panel, how I'm gonna customize my door panel. Thank you very much.